Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Peace, mercy, and blessing be upon all of you. Okay, guys. So in today's video, I'm going to show you how to install Armory Paint in Linux. But before we start, I'm going to show you what is actually my desktop environment. New fetch here. So currently, I'm using Linux Mint 21 which is actually Ubuntu Jemmy Jellyfish 22 and I'm running uh, using the Intel HD graphics 5 set what's this so um, for those of you that doesn't know about armor paint yet so you can open this github page I'll put the link in the description so uh, armor paint is actually like kind of like substance painter and this is actually uh, open source uh, you can get the code from github so you can paint uh, basically anything because this is like a substance painter so you can paint your character or your uh, design and also probably your house if you want like a specific or custom uh, painting style yeah okay, I'm going to show you how to install this so first you need to go to this armor paint and then after that you have to read this first if you are compiling git version for armor paint then you need to have a compiler so if you are using Windows you can use this Visual Studio if we are if you are using Linux then you need to install this C lang plus dependency okay we need to open this in new tab open this in new tab if you are using uh, Mac OS iOS or Android studio then you can uh, click uh, the respective uh, dependencies so I already clicked both of the one that we need for Linux so for dependencies, Linux dependencies, don't use this. This is only for Fedora, but for general Linux like uh, Debian or Ubuntu, like what we have, we need to copy this. Okay, just click the icon. It is copy. Okay, and then after that, open the terminal and then paste it here, paste and then enter. Enter your password. It seems there is some error, but don't worry. So just remove the ceiling first then enter to install everything so if you have a uh, error like myself i'll show you how to install uh, the ceiling okay we just need to finish this Okay, so <clears throat> once it's finished like this, we need to install the ceiling. sudo app install because uh, previously I removed this dependency ceiling. I'll show you. So this is the error that we get if we want to install the ceiling. So to uh, resolve this issue, what we need to do is like instead of using app you sudo app we, need, we will use sudo app the tall ceiling only for this package and then we will resolve it um, keep the following package at their current version mm, no accept this solution because it doesn't work and then 
install the following package accept this solution okay i'll try this solution yes yes it seems there is a a dependency conflict from this ceiling and also from kisa okay i'll downgrade some stuff so therefore we need to use the sudo aptitude install Let's check out the link there. Yep, the link was already installed correctly. I'll try this again. Copy this and then make sure that everything was installed correctly. Okay, so it seems everything has been installed correctly. Okay, and then so this is how to run Silang, but we do not need this we just need to install this dependencies okay so once we already installed the dependencies i'll clear this okay we will start compiling so first we need to copy this first git clone copy paste okay so first we need to install kit sudo app install kit start kit first so make sure you, you already installed kit okay. copy and then paste it here So once uh, we already cloned from it, and then we need to do this. Clear this first, okay? We will start uh, compiling. So we need to CD this first. After that, we will use this instead of Windows or Mac or Android. We will use this link. Okay. So we need to copy this first and then paste it here. Enter. okay so it's finished compiling and then we need to clear this first okay we need to go to this p and 
of the again here and then the last one would be this this okay so it means armor paint works perfectly yeah okay so as you can see you can paint every side that we want okay. so now the next step is how to make it easy so that we do not need to type any comment in this uh in our terminal so so what we can do is that we can go to our file which is should be here so, and then this armor pin and then we will create a uh, new files new document empty document we will name this r more paint dot sh like this and then we will uh, right click and then properties permission make sure that this is will allow ex executing as a program and then we will uh, edit the file open with a uh, text editor usually i use gain or you can use notepad or okay and then after that we will need to this type this we will need to copy some stuff from here okay this one copy this paste but we will need cd r more paint because this is because this is the location of our uh, folder and then after that we will need this okay and then we will need this okay. copy and then paste it here and then make sure that you save this save once it's done like this you can close it and then let's try if it works uh home armor pin okay so make sure that this one has already been this permission allow executing as a program yeah. make sure that it's already been checked and then we will try to open the terminal let's try if it works sh and then drag this to our terminal then enter okay so it works so now the fun part is uh we will go to our desktop like this close it okay and then right click in your desktop and then create a new launcher here and then name this our more paint like this and then find the uh, icon from inside the armor paint so this icon and then for for comment browse and then find the sh file that we already been created earlier this one and then click this message okay okay yes so whenever you need to run the armor pin you can just need to double click the this icon click click and then it will run perfectly fine yep you can also find it from your uh menu armor pin like this and then click and then it will work okay so let's check out so this is using the armor print version 0 0.9 okay okay cool so uh, uh lastly before i finished up if you guys want to support the developer you can get this uh, paid version this paid version is actually um the easiest way if you do not want to install like what we did earlier like uh, typing any comment because this is available for google and app store 
and also from uh gum root yeah you can just need to uh you can support the developer by uh buying their product here okay okay guys so that's all i hope that's helpful uh don't forget to subscribe uh press the bell icon and also share this video if this is helpful for you and i hope it can help somebody out there okay thanks very much see you soon and bye bye wassalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh peace mercy and blessing be upon all of you